Summer is coming quickly and school is just about out for us. One would think I had extra time on my hands, but with so many things to do both inside and out, there is not much time to spare. One thing I have learned over the years is that in order for me to keep up with the housework and manage everything else life requires, I need some form of a daily ritual surrounding these jobs. Something that would keep things in order and ensure the house was maintained throughout each day. I am not one for rigid schedules, although in the past I have tried to keep one. I would write out what I needed to be doing hour by hour, but when life would get in the way, all I was left with at the end of the day was a list of things I couldn't get to. A very defeating feeling and a great way to add unnecessary stress to my day. I think when you start to understand yourself and how you function best, you can work in a way that suits your personality. For me, this would mean structuring my day with a routine over a set schedule. Part of my homemaking routine is to tidy up the house every afternoon just before dinner. I fix the couch cushions, toss away any trash, and put back anything that has been left out. This allows the main parts of the house to be in order every day. Once a week, it is also part of my routine to deep clean the bathroom and then daily pick it up by folding towels, wiping down the countertop, and sweeping if needed. Homemaking routines are daily and even weekly habits that are created out of the needs in your home. Once you establish a good routine, it could be a homemaker's best friend, as it is through a routine that I can find a productive flow. If you would like to learn more about creating a customized routine for your home, I will leave a link to the accompanying blog post for you below. along with the recipe for this easy, natural foaming hand soap. A couple of times a week I like swapping out the dining room tablecloth and putting out a fresh base of flowers. For whatever reason this makes the house feel fresh and inviting. If I've ever had a signature move, this one might be it.
another big part of my daily routine is to clean the kitchen throughout each day instead of allowing the messes to just pile up. Cleaning little bits throughout the day or directly after meals is a lot easier than cleaning a sink load of dishes when all you want to do is end your day. And on that note, once I do the dishes for the final time each evening, I call this putting the kitchen to bed. There will be no more snacking or cooking after that time. And this way, I don't have dishes pile up the next morning and wake up to a sink full of more dishes. Meal times, especially dinners, are included in my routine. I start dinner around the same time each evening, not on a set schedule, but just usually right after my afternoon tidying. Tonight I'm making a vegetarian black bean chili. I will leave a link for a great recipe for black bean chili for you below that is not vegetarian, but you can just leave the meat out if you'd like. 
I have several veggies I need to use up before they go bad, so tonight we're gonna make this vegetarian so I could throw those in. I want to thank you so much for joining me today. I hope you have enjoyed your time with me. Have a great week ahead, and I will see you on the next one.